I think what's always fascinating with a collection like this is that it's really a biography or an autobiography. It's the things that the person chose to have around them. Um, it tells you a huge amount about them, about the way they want to live, the way they've um, really rewarded themselves for their hard work. There's everything from Spike's dog bowl, um, a, a Tiffany bowl uh, that is engraved for her favorite York, a Yorkie uh, at five to $800, up to the Vuilla at three to 400, uh, diamond brooch at 30 to 50. Uh, it's a complete range of, of material. My mother described her living room as if Marie Antoinette had money and taste. It was a really walk in and she had so many incredible pieces of furniture, like the Linky Commode and the Car Model Scream. She had just an amazing art. People said it was like a museum, but it was so warm and inviting that it was like a muse museum that you could actually like go and sit. I think the Fabergé is, is really sort of amazing. Um, it's a little sort of capsule collection within the collection. Um, it's interesting that it, it takes you back to Miss River's roots. Um, her parents were refugees from Russia. Um, so she's collecting things that were aspirational for, for, for Russians of her parents' generation. She's collecting them for herself.